hominid. Here, okay. Hey guys, what's up? Uh. Okay, I commented that if I heard that, I, I would assume there's a woman in the woods who <laughs> fell out of a tree. Okay, okay, be quiet. I'm doing a factory building tutorial. Alright guys, but today we're going to be making a uh, kind of, I guess you could say, good starting factory. Eventually, what? you might want to evolve into something a lot better, but this is for lamps. And this is the only one that I find will actually pretty much work. Um, as you can see, I already have a s little system set up. Uh, basically, you need uh, seven condensers and one chest of your choosing. Oh, okay, that's epic. You're going to want any kind of energy collector. Um, let me see if I have any um, MK2 ones built yet. And this is on our Tech It Noodle server, so it's legitness. All right, not so really. For this one, we're going to be using MK ones, uh, as I don't really have many MK twos, but yet I have tons of MK ones. All right, so basically, once you get this little setup, you're also going to need automatic crafting tables, yes, um, and wooden pipes and stone pipes. Basically, the derpy thing is, we have a factory that automatically makes these wonderful crafting tables. Mm-hmm. So, anyway, once you get this down, you're going to want to put your relays um, on top of the things so that condensing the items is much easier. Um, it doesn't matter where they are, but I'm going to do one for now. Alright, but you're also, what you're going to need is... To make the lamps is you're going to need Lumar, as you can see right here. You're also going to need redstone and some glowstone, which I do have an int I have a pretty big chest of it. So, going to need that. In one condenser, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to put your redstone. This will, uh, because of the relays, or whatever they are, the energy collectors, you will, it will automatically start producing this item. Now, some of them you might want to get multiple, like the glowstone, you might want to give it multiple re um, energy collectors. And the redstone, maybe give that multiple as well. As you can see, what I'm doing right now. But the, depending on whatever dye you're using, you won't really need much. But today we're going to use, we're going to be making yellow lamps. So, you get to watch me go find a yellow flower, which shouldn't be too hard. Oh, they're all over the place near the base. Yeah, see, my friend is very helpful in this, at this time. <laughs> yeah, at this time. Yeah. As, uh, while I'm getting this flower, if you haven't already watched my previous ticket video, um, my friend helped me basically get this started, like my factories and everything. Alright, but now that I've got the yellow dye, we will continue back to my lamp factory, and we will start making the yellow machinery. I will be making... Um, another factory, so it might be better for you guys to view. Well, Ian, I've created a car. And Gary's mod. <laughs> it's not that good. It's basically a dumpster with wheels strapped to it, and then a bunch of kitchen sink rockets in the back. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. But, but it so, works. In the automatic crafting one. table, if you don't already know the recipe for Lumar, you're going to want to put in this recipe. It should be. And just in case I am wrong, I shall oh. use this handy dandy too many items to view the recipe for Lumar. Today we're just going to ba go through one. And yes, I am correct currently. All we need now is some dandelion. Just a little bit more. That lion is so dandy, man. <laughs> oh crap! This and is now you. Me. Oh wait, that's the ghost. <laughs> now you have yellow Lumar. And this is where you're going to be crafting your lamp. 
For the lamp, you're going to need redstone, you're going to need lumar, and you're going to need glass. So, while some stuff is being done, I will grab glass for one of the condensers. Now, for the glass, you might want two condensers, seeing as you will need six pieces of glass. It will just be a lot easier to have two glass condensers. You will also need another redstone condenser unless you really feel like hooking up your one to your one redstone condenser to two different ones. All right, so now that that's doing that here. Let me put this here and this. Just make this a little better for the producing whatever it is. All right. Now you're going to want relays on all of your uh, condensers again, as I've said. Next, you're going to need another redstone condenser, as you've already made your glass ones. And you might want feel like giving it a little boost, in which case you can use some anything with EMC value to give your items boosts. Sweet. So now, Ian, to my car, I just added the ability to turn left and right. That's fun. No. All right, but to get the recipe down, this is taking a little longer. It would be much simpler. But because I'm not really as good at teaching stuff as I may think to myself I am. <laughs> I am taking a little longer than what would be expected. So now you have your yellow lamps. Um, now you're going to need tons of redstone engines. It's going to get pretty crowded. Oh, derp. You might not want to make it this small, per se. Well, actually, no. This design will work perfectly fine, actually. Oh, no, my car is flying. Not That's not supposed it. to happen. No, okay. Maybe the design won't work so fine. Oh my gosh, this car is so All right, epic. But anyway, you might only need one redstone engine for pumping it into The problem your is the wheels glitch out when I go too fast. <laughs> and then they go under the world and I have to get out and fix them. Alright. That's great. Oh right. no, now I'm flying. Oh So basically what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to hook up these redstone engines to all of the wooden pipes. Dude, you sound like one of the British kids who make those Minecraft tutorials. Really? Yeah. Well, you were making one earlier, so... Well, I didn't sound like a British kid. I don't sound British. <laughs> well, you did for a second there. Okay, whatever. You're being weird. Oh, no, Alright, so once you get most down. of your redstone engines placed, what you're going to want to do as many as you possibly can just to sp speed up production rate. But once you get those placed, you need to get redstone torches, which I seem to be lacking of. So we're just going it's to because Matt took them all <laughs> yeah. for his laser project. Okay, but so, as you can see, I have a wooden condenser, which is kind of stupid, but it's very handy at times. Did you say a wooden condenser? Yes. Oh. Oh, a thing that condenses wood. I thought you had a condenser <laughs> made like, out of wood, and that'd I'm like, be epic. That'd be epically stupid, but... Okay, totally I need to make a new ve vehicle. Alright, but... So you want to use as few redstone torches as possible. So in order to do that, you're going to want to put multiple thingamajiggers. Jeez. So you're going to want to use blocks, mostly, to power your top ones. Which can easily be powered. Okay, oh, hey, Ian, for my next vehicle, what base item should I use? You should use a hot tub. No, a pool. Definitely a pool. Okay, let me find it. Right. I think there's a so, pool somewhere in here. Yeah, that's great. Alright, so this is working out pretty well, I think. Cade, oh, crap. however, there's no might pool. think differently. Anyway, there's so... There's no pool. Pick a new item. <laughs> I'm in the middle of a tutorial. I don't know if I want to pick an item. Dude, I found it like a steel bed frame. <laughs> if you know what I mean. 
Yeah, sure. I'm gonna make another one. I'm gonna attach them together. Ah, okay, but you see what I'm doing here. Most of these blocks don't need to be here. It only needs to be the one that holds the redstone torch on it. As you can see, most of the redstone engines have power to them, but you need all of them to have power to them. As you can see, it takes up... It looks kind of messy and everything, but nope. I think it's kind of worth it, worth being the mess. Only for lamp factories, though. Any other factories? Yes. See, go show them my beautiful red matter factory and tell them, hey, this is how a factory okay. should look. But this design is only for lamp factories, because lamp factories, if you use stuff like redstone tubes work for those... This no, is case no, no. red matter factory, which makes lots of diamonds, puts them into a. It's very complicated, and if you're new to yeah. tech it, I wouldn't attempt it. Don't attempt it, and then, but the only, and then he has a UU matter factory in here. I don't know if it's the same. Nope, not the same. It doesn't work the same at all. That yeah. one's actually made entirely out of build craft. It was just yeah. easier for that kind of thing because it was all industrial craft stuff. Mhm. Mm Plus, there were no auto crafting tables. Yeah. Alright, but, so, that red matter factory is what, that's the kind of factory design you're want, gonna want to use for anyone's. Actually, basically, you want to use a factory design similar to this for all of them, but except for lamps, and you're gonna want it to be completed. Uh, we can do another one of those factory kind of tutorials later, but, as you can see... Yeah, this thing's epic. Um, our factory is almost complete. We just need to make sure that it's churning out all the crap that we need it to which it is it is successfully making um lamps so now you have now you know how to make a lamp factory hopefully that's useful who knows anyway see you guys i will try to do another video today or tonight maybe of us playing high or something like that Anyway, see you guys. And it sounded like you said maybe you of us getting play... higher or something like that. <laughs> okay, but if you want to, any requests or anything, just leave them in comments. And please subscribe. See you guys.